Hello there and welcome back to the channel. This is Mel's Gaming here with another Red Dead Redemption 2 online video. Now today we did get the release of the Halloween pass. It has literally just dropped. It is a 15 rank pass that you will get for free if you have bought all four of the previous quick draw passes. But if you haven't, this will say that it costs 20 gold and unfortunately you aren't going to get any of that gold back at all. So yeah, if you if you can get it for free, that I definitely recommend doing it. But of course, if it's going to cost you 20 gold, it's very much up to you. There's some pretty cool rewards in there. Not a whole lot. As I said, it is only 15 ranks. But I am going to go through and show you absolutely everything that's included in the pass. And uh, we'll also take a look at some of the clothing items at the end of the video and all of that kind of stuff. I'm not going to talk the whole way through while we go through all the individual sections of the pass as it's all very self-explanatory. You go through each rank, unlock it through XP, or you can buy the ranks through gold and yeah, and then you can get the nice Halloween rewards. It goes through until November 22nd for this pass, so you do have plenty of time to do it. And yeah, I think it's pretty cool. I'm, I really like some of the rewards. So let's go through now and actually take a look at them.
you came back. Such a long time. Time for a new gun, perhaps? Let me know if I can help you choosing something. I can see you look after your firearm. Okay, so you will have seen the new pump action shotgun variant there and taking a look at some of the really cool looking clothing items from the past. But something I, I need to mention at the end of this video, to get your bound shears and your glabella lantern, you do need to go to the fence to pick that up. They will be free, but you do need to go to a fence to pick those up. I was a little bit confused until I saw that it said weapon rewards are sent to the fence and it does count the lantern as a weapon. Now, unfortunately, I couldn't get a really good look at the lantern as I was on my own, but it is pretty cool. I really like it, and it's definitely the variant of the lantern that I will be using in future. And also, the bound shears look a whole lot better in, like, in-game than they do in the past. They actually look pretty big and pretty cool. So, yeah. That's the Halloween pass. I hope you guys might have found this useful and or enjoyable. And yeah, happy Halloween. I hope you guys have a great time. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.